EcoCity is a very interesting project. Uh, it's taking uh, the promotion of human rights and citizen engagement beyond the classical uh, civil and political rights, beyond the classical cultural and economic rights to uh, environmental rights. EcoCity is about um, getting citizens to understand and engage on the discussion about the quality of life, quality of water, quality of air, quality of their residence, quality of housing. Basically, uh, EcoCity is the, raising the question about like, are we in, living in a real synergy with nature? Is urbanism, is the city we are living in, in harmony? with nature and environment in general. The bootcamp is a very fascinating, fascinating idea um, where we're going to invite uh, different actors. We're going to invite the university students, we're going to invite civil society and human rights organizations. We're going to even invite um, private sectors and the residents of neighborhoods to engage on collecting data, environmental data, and use GIS technologies, collect this data, put it on maps, and analyze it. We are pushing to get citizen engagement. We are changing the, the, the role of citizen from a passive actor who just consumes the information and just complains about things that he doesn't like, to somebody who takes over and owns his own environment and if he doesn't like something he demands for change and even have tools to uh, make the change himself and two we are bringing technology basically very advanced technology to the hands of citizens let's think of GIS for example which like few years ago didn't even this was like a very advanced class in uh, in the universities today is something that's so handy you find it in any mobile phone or like in any Basically, kid with a phone can play with GIS uh, technology. So we bring in basically technology as well as community power to make the change. So what I'm dreaming about, like a few years from now, we can look at a community, at citizens that that make the decisions from themselves and quickly. Today, it's a very centralized. Uh, a bureaucratic model. What we're hoping for is a very decentralized, autonomous, quick, real-time changes so we can have the impact of citizens the way they want it, effectively and quickly.